good morning. Good, good morning, Manxy ladies. We've got Caitlin in here today. <laughs> She's been waiting. She's been waiting and she has picked out and she is going to show for you today her top three repeat winter styles. So she's already got one on. This yeah. is her favorite, her all time yeah. favorite. My homage, so I've worn this this morning. I was lucky enough to nab one of the first lot, but they are back. Um, I love, and you'll see like two of the three boots I picked aren't black. I love a non-black -black boot in winter. But what I do like about the homage is the black lace actually ties into the look if you're then wearing black. So mm. um, that's how, because you guys know already probably by now, I don't love black and colour together. Um, but this is how you can do it. It ties it in quite nicely. Looks so good. Now I'm in the 40 in these, which is my standard size. But you'll see in the other two weeks I've grabbed, I'm in the 41. Because children changed feet, which is kind of annoying. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so that's what I've popped on. With this, got a racer leggings on as well. Yay, super, yeah. super good, super, super good. So yeah. what she's going to do, girls, is she is going to grab out, well, she's grabbed out the Lee boot because she was desperate for these to come back into stock. <laughs> these sold out, remember, ladies, these sold out so, so quickly. Really super duper quickly. Uh, well, Caitlin is going to um, unbox those uh -huh. and try those on. We've got May <laughs> in the wings here uh, in her sports luxe look. Uh, she's got her little... Um, a little pinky hoodie. Designer oh, hoodie. Yes. Designer hoodie, princess tee yeah. on, yeah. Uh, her leggings, because we are still moving all the cartons around the warehouse. Oh, uh, so uh, we're seeing people coming in now. So um, yesterday, ladies, we had issues with the live and the comments not showing, and we really apologised. Yeah. We hit something that disabled something oh. else. Yeah, Great. so we've got it sorted now. Oh, um, yeah. Caitlin gave us a bit of a tip and a trick, and it's worked. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. So, um, so yeah, Nay's picked out. I've only got two, because I didn't have much time. I'm sure I can find a third. Okay, but, we might be able to unbox a third. I, thought, I don't oh, know. Oh, cute. Oh, yes, perfect. Comments are working. Oh, comments are working. <laughs> Fantastic. So, Nay has grabbed out look at this Yippee this patootie. oh so cute oh, this yeah. is your beautiful bandit sneaker ah. in a brand new uh spring summer colorway now we did run this in the perla which i will show you as well uh, we we did like a quick little um autumn injection of this mm. i think um so we decided we needed to do the bandit sneaker the lace-up version as well um which is just delightful in the pink gingham Oh, thanks, 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 thanks. Close up. Crazy, they go with yeah. my outfit. <laughs> How funny that. <laughs> so you can see there, Nay's got that on. So she's doing that whole, you know, weekend warrior, mother, yep. busy sport, out, out and about. Yep. Put my little um, running to the raincoat on over top. Yeah, watching you know. the sports and things. So I'm just going to throw down the um, the perla and the so we've got if you missed out on this the first time round all the new sizes have come back into stock as well ladies so you've got a slip on version if you just want to slip on and run out with the pearls or you've got that lovely lace up new version uh, and the bandit sneaker it's got that grow grain lace rubber sole branded sole um, yep the you look good sole and all of that jazz so mm -hmm. you know these are comfy and they are super fun yeah. so they are all heading out to your retailers in the next few days these uh, repeat uh, the new colorway and the bandit yep. Yep. so Nay's going to try on another little surprise sneaker for you um, and in the meantime look at this. well it's like <laughs> I feel like I'm directing like a play <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, so yeah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So we've got Caitlin and she's grabbed out her the Lee boot. I'm going to call it her boot because she's <laughs> I'm just, obsessed with this boot. She loves it, yeah. um, especially with all your dresses and skirts, your patterned maxi dresses and things. Hey, exactly. I love the idea, and I talk with my one-on-one -on -one clients about um, finding your style personality. And my style personality is feminine, edgy, and elevated. So the boots for me add the, the edgy to yeah. quite feminine styles and dresses and yeah. that kind of thing as well. So these are going to be a big winner for the rest of winter. But I also love the idea because they're white, wearing them into spring summer as yeah. well because you don't feel like you've got that heavy boot with the floral dress. Yeah. Um, so up, right up my alley. Now this is the 41, is it Ella? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Um, and like I said, my feet, since having my third baby, had just changed a smidgen. So I can get away with 40s, but I do feel more comfortable in a 41 in these. Yeah. Um, the buckle, as you guys probably know, can come off. So if you want them more plain, 
look there you can do that as well and also if you are talking about styling of this too and um, what is quite fun if you're doing that grungy sort of look particularly with the legging is sort of unlacing some of this and just kind of relaxing the whole ankle leg um sort of fit mm. uh, and you could almost wrap that like. around that you could almost wrap your laces around oh, once yeah. and do that so there is a little bit of um kind of doc martin style, yeah it is kind right? of it is 90s yeah 90s grunge yeah so that's just a night you know it kind of relaxes all this fit here and yeah. it's like a bit more casual looking um so yeah you can definitely have a play with this boot this is lovely just a reminder this is restocked now at uh at repertoire clothing they uh, all the boxes were released yesterday for them so they'll be in store for the weekend ladies so wherever you are in the country there pretty much is a repertoire store so yeah. big shout out to them for restocking this um very cool boot so right. great boot for me like i said if i'm not wearing black yes. so if you want something that's a little bit brighter um, even the, um, the homage, homage have the black laces, so it can feel a bit heavy, whereas the, the Lee just has that lightness and that freshness. So if you are wearing lighter colours um, in your winter wardrobe, these are a great um, addition. I mean, we'll do a little bit of a focus on winter white. I think. We've kind of yes, had it sitting there for ages, it, yeah. but we're waiting for these to come back yeah. in. So yeah, how do we winter white is coming at you yeah. shortly. So, so. Uh, I guess probably one other thing to point out about the Lee boot is this fraction. It's the highest boot up the leg. Um, that's a kind of lace up. It's kind of that high mid boot, um, rather than it being a knee two. high. Yeah. So it just gives you that ability to wear it um, with a bit more flexibility with skirts and dresses and things like that as well. So um, it is a, it is higher up the leg than say the dazed boot that you have seen mm. um, this winter, um, which is quite nice, particularly for this time of the year. Uh, right. Over here. <laughs> Woo, <made laughs> Do we make you feel seasick? Yeah. yeah. Uh, so now Nay has just popped on. We showed you this um, as a new. Uh, Bay Pearl sneaker. Bay Pearl gem. Bay Pearl gem sneaker. Yep. And this is the new tortoiseshell. So, actually, I'm going to call it and say this is Renee's baby because she saw these tortoiseshell gems when they came down in stud oh, form. And she was like, oh my God, the ladies are going to love it. It's almost like so... the tortoiseshell could be like a little bit animally leopardy yeah. if you want it to be. Uh, it's just a fraction pop of attitude and. A little point of difference that makes mm. them a little bit special. Mm -hmm. um, of course, you've got that beautiful rubber sole again, thicker rubber sole. And what about the sizing there, Nay? Well, I've got a 41 on, but in the bay band, I do tend to go down. Mm. In the bay band last, I, I wear a 40. So, so I've got, but I've got a 41 the, on in this. So the bandit and sneaker the, you had on was what size? A 40. A 40. Yep. And the and this one here, the bay is curl is this a... This is a 41, but it's too big. just a little bit too big. I'd probably go with a 40. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. We switched what size is today, Nay? What's that? We switched what size I know, sizes. I know, how weird is that? <laughs> I know, but in, this, in my bay bands, I did go with a 40. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, right, any comments from the ladies, Ella? It's still quiet. Adele says, good morning, gorgeous ladies from the sunny Hawke's Bay. Oh, oh sunshine. Nice. Yeah. We'll be there soon. Yeah. 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 yeah, we're on our way. Yeah. <laughs> See ya. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, so this was the other boot that, um, like I said yesterday, this sold out so, so quickly. Um, I think it was maybe under a week. Um, and again, because it is that slightly higher up the leg, uh, and it also has that flexibility with style, styling. So you've got that front zipper. That is fully functional, so you can kind of uh, open it out a little bit there, uh, particularly for, so, like, um, Caitlin's fine. She's got a lovely slender leg. For someone like myself that's got more of a, um, a thicker thicker uh, ankle and things, it's quite nice to be able to have that ability to relax the fit around the leg. Um, and then on the inside of the boot, you have an easy in and out zipper as well to help you get in and out of this. Um, again, you've got that black oil leather, uh, which is, it gives it a little bit more of a dressy feel. Um, to I guess more versatility to mm -hmm. wear in different um, occasions rubber sole on that now uh, the detailing in through the back of the heel um, which is super super lovely that plate um, and and of course the pearls yeah and the pearls I think for me is what caught my eye because again it's that mixture of the kind of the edgier grungier look but the femininity in the pearls so if a that kind of combat style boot maybe yes. feels a little bit too heavy and too masculine for you really great way to add that femininity into your look because yeah. I think sometimes people think a flat boot is quite masculine yes. um, but can be very feminine we've got the kind of nice arm and toe shape and then the pearls yeah making it feel a little bit more girly nice. we've got some comments um love the gingham love your work kush sure <laughs> Shirley love the tortoiseshell. Megan says yes, yes. Now that tortoiseshell is ab fab. Ab fab, yeah. 
Do you honestly, um, yeah, Nate honestly was looking at those going, because I had all the other sparkly ones out, she's like, no, I think the ladies will really like this. So, um, yeah, so it's good. It's good to have that feedback. It's good to have a variety of comments and things. And Chris said, anything coming out in blue? Oh. Oh. Did, did we have anything in blue? I don't Navy? I can't. Can't. We, oh, it's so funny you say that because I've designed these, mm. um, uh, the beautiful high heeled court shoe um, in that cobalt blue, mm. um, but it's not coming in for a little while yet. So what kind of blue are you looking for? Are you looking for a navy, a cobalt, uh, a sky blue? Um, I mean, we've got blue tone shoes like the, um, the bold blues, um, which oh, yeah. uh, has got a lot of sort of blue tone in it. Uh, in, in fact, you, go, you girls um, grabbed the gravitated towards these yesterday. We saw quite a few of these yesterday, which is quite good. Um, they, this, this is in the Willet boot as well, um, which we could try and find. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We've got the stylist on the job for you. Here's a couple of blue options. Oh, look at you go. Yeah. Yeah. So Caitlin's grabbed out um, the hot, uh, the point pop in a blue microfiber suede. A bit of a pointed toe in it. Little blocky heel. Um, microfiber suede has got that stretch in it. Inside zipper. Nice and easy to wear. If you want a slightly um, square toe and um and a fraction lower in the heel height there a little bit more blocky looking all over um same principle it's a nice ink stretch suede micro suede inside zipper on it so like a mod kind of feel to it yeah it, it does yeah, kind of yeah yeah austin powers yeah um, <laughs> yeah absolutely so that's your um your crush boot mm -hmm. uh this is a beautiful navy milled leather um you've got that kind of slightly gritty grungy um, small cleat on the sole, a beautiful contrasting leather rand with the bold white stitch. Uh, you've got this kind of gimping, broguing, sort of patterning, punching in the leather, which breaks it up from being a, you know, navy Solid. shoe. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, um, and again, you've got like, that lovely blocky uh, leather stacked heel on that. Is that the kind of colour tone you were looking at? Um, or was it something else? Chris hasn't said yet. Oh, she hasn't said Huh, you've got to let us know. Yep. You've got to let us know. Right, who wants to see? I do have a few more yeah, questions. Few more yeah, Gwendol okay. says, love the new bandits. Can we please see the other patterns? Oh, and the other bandits, Nika. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, Navy Willet. And that's quite cool because it's got the contrast white stitch on it. So um, it brings the sole into the leather, if that kind of makes sense. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Uh, what have we got here? We need... Oh, they, yeah. oh, here we go. Yep. Here we go, girls. I'll bring it closer. I'll bring it closer. Right. So we've got, doing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, does anyone want to see anything on Nate? Yeah, while, while Renee's here, Megan says, what is the pink hoodie Renee is wearing? Oh, this is our uh, lovely designer hoodie. Um, we've still got a couple in stock, actually. Yeah, mm. um, I'm wearing the small medium, which is probably perfect mm. for yeah. me. Yeah, the small um, medium. Um, some know. really cool mm. things about that hoodie, actually, mm -hmm. is that it does cover the butt, which is quite nice. Mm. Mm. Um, <laughs> it's got a two-way zipper system on it, so you can unzip from the bottom um, if you want to have that more relaxed feel like that. Mm -hmm. um, you've got pockets with a satin trim, uh, and you've got satin lining in the back of that hoodie as well. Uh, mm. which is really, really feminine mm. and quite pretty. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, and, and it's just been designed so you can put layers underneath it. So it's yep. quite a generous sort of yeah. um, sort of body fit. Yeah, and you've got satin trim on the uh, uh, all the dangly mm. ties and things. Yep. Dangle dangles. I'm going to call them dangly dangles. dangles. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Good. Oh, oh, oh. Look at this. Look at this. I have to show you this. I have to show you. Oh, Do you want to try this? Oh, gosh, here you go. Oh, look. Yes. Oh, look at this. Okay, Hello. you want pattern. This is pattern. This is a beautiful, I think we called it pink lily pad. Pink lily pad. So, oh, it's so cute. It's so bright and fresh. So, particularly for these winter months or going into spring, wow, what a cool punch of colour. Uh, if you are travelling overseas, ladies, you take these with you and people will stop you in the streets and and um, ask them mm. where they got from, and then you can like start selling them overseas for us and we'll be really <laughs> happy about that. Anyway, so that's another colourway. Uh, so we've got that's a new print. Um, there was a you you did a purple. Yeah, yeah I don't know. I don't one. know where that is. I tried to look for it while I was. Um, we're gonna have shall purple we have... pop multi. It's called. I think. Um, yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. Here's, here's another one here. Let's it's this not one. The purple. One. Let's have a look at this one. This is uh, emerald this stencil flower. Oh, yeah, Gosh, I can't weird. even. Some of these. I'm on to the next season already, and I. It's like trying to remember. 
say exactly where. Okay, let's have a look in here. Mm. Okay, emerald stencil flower. Yeah, again, green tones. A lot of green tones coming through. Oh, look at that. That with denim is going to be mm -hmm. so pretty. pretty. So, so pretty. So you can see little tones of green, like the mint there, um, slightly, you know, little pastel-y tones in this as well. So you've got the mint green and then a slightly bolder, darker green, the same version. There's a little hint of dusty pink or a lilac-y sort of shade in there um, with that um, stencil stencil uh, leaf pattern on it, which is quite cool. Yes, yeah, Caitlin's got the other one over there, which was... We seaweed Bright. Seaweed Bright. So we profiled that yesterday. That is so fun. So oh, actually, if you be... held that against what you've oh, got yeah. on there, now, you could be like yeah. rocking the look, girl. Oh, yeah, yeah that's yeah, perfect. Rocking it. Uh, so yeah, uh, what else do we... Purple There's, Pot Multi. Yeah, yeah, Purple Pot Multi, multi is what I... You pulled uh, it out yesterday, right? But no, we have, I don't think we... Yeah, I did. Got, you took a photo. Oh, did you take it's a photo? Right? One. I'll have to go down the other aisle. Oh, we're having a big old group chat about it. Let's just... Should we just keep unboxing, ladies? Mm. <coughs> Do this one. Oh, wait, that's not our box. <laughs> that's sunshine. <laughs> uh, uh, what's this one here? Uh, oh, this is actually a new set. Yeah, let's do it. Let's show them a new style. No one's watching. Um, I mean, the other girls aren't watching. Have a look at this one. This is called Jane. So, for any of the Janes out there. Yeah, um, get it. Did you find it? Uh, let's have a look. Here we go. This is a new little style. If you like that Willet lift, uh, if you like uh, Catch It, Elevate Me, that kind of thing, um, this here is, yeah, that's what Jane, yeah, so we were talking about this yesterday. Um, so this little style here is really quite cute. It looks slightly, is it, I'm going to say it looks slightly unbalanced in a picture image like that. I don't know if through your screen it looks like that. On. When you put this shoe on, it comes to absolute life. It's very, very cool and very, very cute. So basically, you've got um, some uh, oval uh, lacing eyelets through here, but these are just elasticated, so there's no blimmin' lacing in and out of anything here. Uh, and then you've got, we've got like a little elasticated back strap on this. So basically, you're slipping into like a little cloggy style. So um, I was telling ladies on the weekend that these cloggy styles are just like hugely coming back on trend. We was too early with the, um, what, what did we call that, that other one? Um, oh, I can't remember, the, the mint green that we had. Anyway, so yes, this, these are very, very cool. I'm missing out on all the fun. Who's here? Who's here? Someone's coming and I don't know who it is. Anyway, so that is Style Jane. It's only available on white with the punch of black here. So that really cool little sports luxe look. If you want to wear a mule and you can't participate um, because you need a back strap, this is going to solve that problem. Who is that? This is Paula coming oh, to pick up Paula. her boots. So, go so and do, do that. you remember um, Paula? We showed Paula her name on the carton. Um, not that she's yeah. buying a carton of shoes. Yes. But, um, this is another one yeah, that we're yeah, going to You're oh, buying a carton of shoes. Purple pop yeah. multi. Again, perfect outfit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Look at all this colour. You want more colour? No. We need a bit of colour. Like we need a bit of, we need a bit of colour in the middle. But of I winter. love the idea of like Ella popping that back with like just her metallic skirt and black kind yeah. of thing. Should we, should we do good. that? Should we hold it here? I'll switch you over. Um, oh, oh, I just put my finger over the. How could I do that? Here's little beautiful Ella, who's been very busy making fancy music videos for the industry she's like a little clever lady um so yeah so she's got like a beautiful little silver pleated skirt on today um and you can see that back with like a little silver pleat we might just even get you to hold it up against the skirt um it yeah it does it does um so you can see that pattern on it isn't it cute look at all those colors there's like a so you know like ladies there was a few ladies that was uh, were asking for purple like mm -hmm. constantly in our lives mm -hmm. so this is going to give you that rich purple um and then uh, kind of the ability to wear it back with a lot more because it's got that little yep. lemony mustard in it uh, that blushy pink and a hint of um teal, teal which is quite nice tiffany yeah. blue that's tiffany what blue. i love about prints like that is they've got the ability to match it back with so many colors my favorite thing with print mm -hmm is to look for the least obvious colour. So in that case, it yeah. would be the teal blue. Like, that would yeah. be a really fun way to like pull that pop of colour out yeah. um, and match it back. So print has such a power to tell you what colours to match it back mm. with. with. Like, don't, you don't have to default to black 
white yeah. when it comes to a print. Here's the print. It yeah. tells you. It talks oh, to you. So it does. It does. Yeah. So many options. So many options. Uh, so I can't see. I didn't see. Oh, I don't have my glasses on. Oh, my kid. I didn't see any other comments on there. So Are we showing the next step? The, are we show, oh, yeah. We could show. The, just the uh, thing. I, I put you a little black pair out for you. Oh, it's, um, in, it's in the office. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, just as you go into the office, I think. Uh, so next step, um, which we did, uh, maybe I've got, should I have a quick look to see whether, we had a box, so we were we'll, unboxing some yesterday. I think. Or did I move them around, did I move them around? There was a white one somewhere. Bite marks, bite marks, you girls have been blowing up the bite marks, that's the bite marks there. Uh, <laughs> sorry ladies. This was the little shoe we showed you yesterday in the candy pink. Um, with that lovely sort of pleated sole and that, look at that. I won't unwrap it because this is going home to somebody. Um, so it, I want it to look all nice uh, for them. Um, Should we go online, over? It's online. We might need to oh, wander no. down. So I'll just pop that away so we don't... Oh, it. she's got it on. Here we go. Uh, she's got it on. How it, Oh, yeah. Oh, here's sophisticated Caitlin. Here's sophisticated Caitlin. Introducing the new sophisticated Caitlin. <laughs> So this is a um, brand new style out. It's a, a new winter injection style. A uh, little heeled, um, well, loafer really, dress loafer, uh, slash court shoe. And this is the, uh, yesterday we showed it to you in the, was it white? Yeah. Did we profile the white in it yesterday? Mm -hmm. uh, so Caitlin's just put the black on and you'll see that it's contrasted with that lovely dark gun um, horse bit tab across the front of the shoe there. Uh, now, Caitlin, I, we gave you a 41 to try yes. that. How was the size of that? That's good. Yeah, it's a good size for mm -hmm. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, you've got to kind of push through to get uh, down past your instep into this. Uh, but once you push through and get and, and your foot sits down and it does settle down. So, mm. and just remember with these styles of shoes, they do need to be firm to start with because they do They'll give... And it's that firmness is the only thing that's actually holding that onto your foot. So you don't want it to be slipping off at the heel as you're running across the road at the traffic For your lights. coffee. Yeah. yeah, for your coffee. Yeah. Now, one thing I did when I went to put it on, there yeah. was um, a little tiny bit of tissue just down the bottom. So, oh. <laughs> so when you're taking it out of the box, make sure you get all the tissue. And I'm like, why would it go on? And it was because there was a little bit more. Oh, bottom. they've got extra stuff yes. in it. And yes. yes. So um, Renee <coughs> took, this, uh, took a pair home to her gorgeous girlfriend to try last night. And she was like, oh my gosh, these are so, so <laughs> slippery. Running down the aisle there. Yeah, 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 so, so slippery. So what the factory's done, ladies, is they've actually covered the sole for us with like a protective, um, a protective layer. So it just starts in up on, under here and it just peels off. It's really quite a simple thing to do. And what this does is it means that it keeps it in tip-top condition for, um, for anyone purchasing them, obviously, and for our retailers and things. So once you know that you want to own this shoe, um, take that off and what it reveals is it has a rubber padding in through here so it actually is non-slip um, so you get that beautiful finish um, of the sole look uh, around here the resin through here and you've got that rubber pad to prevent you from slipping but we've just got that on there so that when you get these shoes they are in pristine condition you can unwrap them and um, yeah and then start using them or wearing them Mm. So it should be very important to remember because it is very slippery. If yes, you don't. yes, so. yes. And I mean, in fact, we may even talk to some of our retailers. They may pre-take them off before mm. um, they send them out. Uh, and we, we, I don't know whether we should or shouldn't do that. Mm. Um, but I mean, if if you take them, if you're buying online, you get them home. They're the wrong size or whatever, and you send them back. And we prefer to still have that covering on them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so we'll put a little says, reminder in the boxes. Yeah, yeah. If yeah. you're ordering from HQ, you would put yeah. a little reminder that says, "Don't forget to take the protective." Yeah, exactly. Don't want to slip over. No, don't yeah. want to slip over. Yeah. Aren't they beautiful though? Gosh, mm. they're so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. um, so, too. are they? Yeah, they are. good on you? Yeah, fantastic. Yeah. They've got extra little bit of padding in the insole of those. Mm. Uh, because, you know, with those, when you're standing on the ball of your foot a little mm. bit more, you need that. Uh, just a reminder, the candy pink has already sold out here at the HQ. Uh, so you will only be able to buy that through your local retailer. Um, and it comes in the white and also in the black. Uh, we wanted to also give a bit of a shout out to a boot that's come back into stock again um, and stomps down in Timaru, we're talking about it. Um, it is, we just want to show you, it might be quicker to actually find it. Where is it? We're going on a little hunt. I think it is. It. it will um, be behind here. Oh, is this it? Is this it here? Yeah. I think this is it here. This is the boot here. It is called Tonic. 
Um, so, you know, this is actually the perfect little South Island boot, dare I say it. So, Stomps is in Tamaru. This is, it's a 36. Maybe I could put it on to show you how it works. So, you've got that lovely uh, sort of grungy stole. I'm going to say it's a Stella McCartney inspired grungy sole. Lots of lugs on it. Uh, you've got a fancy midsole in here and um, a lovely rand in it. The coolest thing about these chunkier, heavier soles is the comfort that they provide. Um, and so you're getting all of that kind of like cushioning and things like that from the sole. Inside you've got the lovely uh, pop of red uh, insole in there and then you've got all that memory foam on the inside as well. Now you've got leather, uh, nappa leather coming through here, but what's in around the ankle area here is a lovely stretch nappa, as um, stretching sheep nappa. So uh, let's put it on, you've got the zip that goes up the front. I'm just gonna take the Kelsey's off. <laughs> whoa! And, whoa, I know. These here, my gosh, <coughs> these have just been going off the chain. Mm. I'm glad that you are loving this new sneaker because it's such a cool look. And we need to we loved it at the start, me and you. Oh, yeah, yeah, you and I were all, all over it. Uh, and um, now I think the girls are getting used to it, mm. aren't they? So I've just got the 36 on, which is a little, it's going to be, I'm normally a 37, so it is definitely a little bit smaller. Um, so here we go. Oh, no, it doesn't look that great with my, my, my um, cafe leggings, my run, run around sending out stock leggings. Uh, so yeah, so that's what it looks like on. So this is style tonic. T-O-N-I-C, and this really is a perfect high winter booty. So you imagine these with a black um, legging, you imagine these with a black opaque tight, uh, and then like a like your tunic dresses, some of those lovely floaty chiffon overlayers to mm. kind of feminize the grunge of the sole. But yeah, it's a lovely, lovely comfortable rubber outsole, um, a lovely soft sheep napper leather. And just remember, that's a size too small for me, but that is feeling pretty darn good. Uh, and again, you can style it. If you've got a slimmer ankle, you can pull that right up firmly around the leg. Uh, if you're a little bit like more like myself, a little bit of a chunkier leg, you can just... It's more than acceptable just to have that zip kind of like that. Mm -hmm. uh, so that there is Style Tonic. And just a reminder, if you're hunting for stock um, of it, it's, it's come back into stock. And uh, Stomps and Timaru have got this available and ready for you. I think they've got a full size. Right? Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Uh, okay, is that all? Oh, have you got any questions there? That is all, you? that is all. Okay, well, as you can see, we still have a lot of cartons around us. Uh, and we're desperate to get these all out to our retailers for the weekend, uh, just in time for the start of the school holidays. So mums, make some time for yourself uh, to go and see your local retailer and see what's new from Minx in their stores. Alrighty, have a great day. Bye. Bye.